Nine Worst Foods for Fatty Liver Today we're embarking on an eye-opening journey through the nine worst foods for fatty liver disease. Liver disease is a silent epidemic affecting millions of people, but also children surprisingly enough. You'll be surprised to discover the everyday food villains from the sweet traps of sugary drinks to the deceptive allure of your favorite snacks. Get ready to unveil the hidden truths and transform your diet to safeguard your liver. Stay until the end as we share one secret weapon that will help you fight liver damage naturally. This could add years to your life. Stay tuned. Number nine, liquid sugar. Did you know that your favorite sweet drinks might do a number on your liver? Let's talk about sodas, energy drinks, and those so-called healthy fruit juices. These drinks are often loaded with added sugars, especially high fructose corn syrup, a major villain for your liver. This syrup acts like a Trojan horse sneaking into your liver and depositing fat. Here's a shocking fact. A single can of regular soda can pack almost 10 teaspoons of sugar. To put it in perspective, the American Heart Association suggests a daily sugar limit of six teaspoons for women and nine for men. So just one can of soda can easily put you over the limit. This sugar overload forces your liver to work overtime, converting sugar to fat, leading to a condition known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. And it's not just sodas, even those fruit juices in your fridge can be loaded with added sugars. Plus, these sugary drinks contribute to obesity, diabetes, and heart disease, which further complicates liver health. Disclaimer. We are here to share valuable insights, but remember, we are not your go-to for medical advice. This content is for educational purposes only and does not substitute professional medical care. Always consult your physician for personalized guidance. Number eight, refined carbohydrates. Now, let's turn to the world of refined carbs. White rice, pasta, cakes, cookies, you name it. These foods might satisfy your cravings, but do your liver no favors. When you eat these white carbs, they quickly break down into sugar in your body. Your liver, acting as the body's sugar manager, has to process all this sugar, turning it into fat and storing it. This is like giving your liver an endless job without a break. What's more, these refined carbs spike your insulin levels, which can mess with your blood sugar balance. Over time, this can lead to insulin resistance, a stepping stone to type two diabetes, and, you guessed it, fatty liver disease. These foods lack essential nutrients like fiber, vitamins, and minerals, making them the ultimate empty calories. Your liver needs nutrients to function properly, but refined carbs just add to its workload without providing any benefits. It contributes to chronic inflammation in the body. Number seven, fast foods. Fast food is quick and easy, but it's a disaster for your liver. These foods are overflowing with saturated and trans fats, making them extremely hard for your liver to process. If it's fast, it's likely highly processed. These foods often contain harmful additives and preservatives that add to your liver's burden. Plus, they can lead to inflammation in your body, which over time can turn into serious liver conditions like non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, NASH, and eventually cirrhosis. This is when fatty deposits can form as well as scarring in your liver and it can't function properly. Once there is scarring in the liver, it's difficult to turn back from that. And let's not forget the cholesterol game these foods play. High levels of bad cholesterol, LDL, and low levels of good cholesterol, HDL, affect your heart and liver. Stay tuned as we dive deeper into our list of worst foods for your liver because the truth is, what you don't know can hurt you. Number six vegetable oils. It might surprise you, but those common vegetable oils in your kitchen, like canola, cottonseed, sunflower, corn, soy, and grapeseed are not as friendly as they seem. They're actually like secret agents causing inflammation in your body. These oils are loaded with omega-6 fatty acids. A little omega-6 is okay, but the large amounts found in these oils can cause an imbalance in your body. This imbalance can lead to inflammation, and guess who gets hit hard by this? Your liver. Too much omega-6 can create an environment in your body that's ripe for developing liver diseases. It's like creating a party where the bad guys outnumber the good guys. What's the solution? Switch to oils that are kinder to your liver, like olive oil or avocado oil. 
These oils are rich in omega-9 and omega-3 fatty acids, which are like the superheroes for your liver. Are you still with us? Stick around as we unveil more foods that if avoided could add years to your life. Number five, alcohol. If your liver had a most wanted list, alcohol would be at the top. As discussed in a previous video, alcohol is linked to fatty liver disease. Here's why. Every time you drink alcohol, your liver has to work over time to break it down. There is a whole conversion process your liver has to do, converting ethanol, that so-called molecule of drunkenness. This is because your liver sees alcohol as a toxin and wants to get rid of it as quickly as possible. But this process can be really tough on your liver cells and can lead to damage. More recent studies have shown that even one to two drinks can have a detrimental effect on your body and brain. According to a New York Times article published in January 2023, even a little alcohol can harm your health. Recent research makes it clear that any amount of drinking can be detrimental. If you think about it, your liver does not differentiate between one drink or 10 drinks. Your liver is on call and gets to work as soon as you take that first sip of alcohol. What does this mean for your health? Well, frequent and heavy drinking can lead to some serious liver problems like alcoholic hepatitis, fatty liver, and eventually cirrhosis. Cirrhosis is when your liver gets scarred so badly that it can't heal. Number four, bread. Not just any bread, but white bread made from refined flour. It seems innocent enough. But here's the catch. This type of bread is packed with refined grains that your body quickly converts into sugar. And this sugar heads straight to one place, your liver. When your liver gets overloaded with sugar, it turns into fat, which can lead to fatty liver disease. It's like your liver is constantly under attack from these hidden sugars. Over time, this can cause a buildup of fat in the liver, which is unhealthy and dangerous. It's one of the main reasons behind the increasing cases of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Moreover, white bread lacks essential nutrients like fiber, vitamins, and minerals. It's like eating empty calories that give you a quick energy boost, but no nutritional value. Wait, hold on. You thought the first five foods were bad for your liver? Well, you won't believe what's coming up next. Number three, foods high in salt. Salt, the common ingredient in most kitchens, can silently threaten your liver. It's not just about the taste. Too much salt leads to water retention, creating extra work for your liver. This is especially true with processed foods, canned soups, and those tempting savory snacks like chips and salty biscuits. The average American consumes about 3,400 milligrams of sodium daily, above the recommended 2,300 milligrams. And where does all this excess sodium come from? Mostly from processed and packaged foods. These foods can contain hidden salt, which quickly burdens your liver and contributes to high blood pressure, a risk factor for liver disease. Processed cheese, often loaded with salt and saturated fats, is another hidden hazard. These foods cause your body to retain water, putting additional pressure on your liver to filter out the excess. Over time, this can lead fat accumulation in the liver and in turn to chronic inflammation and scarring in the liver, known as fibrosis, which can progress to cirrhosis. Number two, baked goods. Baked goods, muffins, cookies, cakes, are irresistible treats for many. However, these delicious delights are often packed with sugar and fats, posing a serious threat to your liver. High consumption of these sugary snacks can lead to obesity, a major risk factor for developing fatty liver disease. The primary ingredient in most baked goods is refined white flour, which your body rapidly converts into sugar. This sugar then travels straight to your liver, converting it into fat. Over time, this can lead to a buildup of fat in the liver, known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD. But it's not just the sugar. Many baked goods are also high in unhealthy fats, like trans fats and saturated fats, which can further damage your liver. These fats can increase inflammation, oxidative stress, and insulin resistance, contributing to liver damage. Number one, whipped cream. Surprising, isn't it? Whipped cream, a popular topping for your extravaganza coffees and desserts, might seem harmless, but it's quite the opposite for your liver. Loaded with calories, sugar, and saturated fats, whipped cream can be detrimental to liver health. 
Just one cup of whipped cream contains about 23.2 grams of saturated fat, which can significantly contribute to fatty liver disease. Saturated fats are known to increase the accumulation of fat in the liver, leading to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD. This type of fat can also increase inflammation and insulin resistance, both harmful to the liver. Moreover, the high sugar content in whipped cream can lead to obesity and type 2 diabetes, both of which are risk factors for liver disease. The liver plays a crucial role in metabolizing sugar, and a high intake of sugary foods like whipped cream can overload the liver, leading to fat buildup. And there you have it, the top nine offenders in the battle against liver health. Were you surprised by some of the items on this list? As promised, it's time to reveal one secret weapon to support your liver. Start drinking a glass of warm lemon water in the morning on an empty stomach. This magical trick can easily be incorporated in your daily routine and is free. And believe me, your liver will thank you in the long run. Why? Morning lemon water helps your body detox by activating bile flow for a more squeaky clean liver. If this video opened your eyes, show us some love with a like, and don't forget to hit subscribe for more health revelations. At Remedy, me, we care about you and your health. Tell us what videos you would like to see.